Okay. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo, maybe not that. Not that. And we'll keep him one of those. Pretty good hand. But eight is a dangerous farm. If we play the smuggler, it might just die. But there's not much else we can do. Let's do it. Thoughts on Nilfgaard rework. Uh, all I know is that it's apparently happening. Is there any more information about it? Uh, let's play the on board. Cool guy though. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I haven't seen anyone uh, play... Oh, well, I mean, um, play. Uh, wear hey, toe shoes before. So, one brave man for sure. Let's hit that. We could have played the Dobratana center with a uh, Brewer move. We can also... Play a Kieran, but let's just go with the boost. Psst! You just received 50 meteorite powder for watching a Witcher World game on Twitch. Oh, you have? Holy crap. It's happening, finally. You're getting rich. The only one who doesn't get anything <laughs> is me. Like, literally, why doesn't it count? Okay, sure, like, I'm having a lot out of this, you know? I'm just a lot of fun. But I never get anything for it. Apparently that me streaming the game doesn't fucking count. It only counts if I'm... I'm actually... In the chat as well, but it never counts. No species, more well, I don't know. I never got anything so far. Mm, we just want to lock that. Humans are not to be trusted. Okay, twelve point lead. That's kind of good. Okay, fourteen point lead. That's pretty good. Don't you think? I'm passing. You would need to play two cards. Okay, no, no, no. I don't know. It is pretty damn tempting. But I can move back the boar and also play nine points. Well, that's, that's, okay, that's, that's eight points. Or I just pass. But if I pass, you might have me. Good question. You might even do it. What do you guys think? Push your... Oh, you got it? What? I think I'm just gonna pass. You would need to play a pretty impactful unit. Oh, he's going with the big knight, man. Okay. But that's fine. He used up all the charges, plus his big man. Now, Drag, what has happened to you? Did you say fucking instead of fucking? You need to get out of the north <laughs> soon before it takes your soul. Did I do that? If it happened, I didn't realize it. Maybe it's already too late. Do we keep the... Well, the Alvin Scott could be awesome. And these could be really good. Combined with, together. There's really not much else I can really hope for here. This is amazing. I think there's a decent chance that he's just gonna pass. Okay, let's play a Dryad Matron. Careful. And move that. Don't it. That's annoying. We're not dealing with that. 
What? No! No pass! What are you guys on about? We're not passing. Oh, he's all about removal. Okay, let's play a Ragnarok on him. I don't love it, but... Wake up, dwarves! Humans lust after our ladyfolk! Well, we can play this. He's gonna get hit again. Shockingly, he got the balls and the means to push me. Now we can play a Yorbit's Gambit. One crushing trap is guaranteed. Other one, not so much. But this is still fine. Yeah. We're still at a fine spot. Hey, watch your step. If he's gonna keep going, yeah. That was extremely ballsy for him. But we got some Yorvet with Yorvet's Gambit. Could be pretty good. Okay, the Pit Trap. Amazing. So, this could be useful. Swordmaster is gonna be less good. And we gotta be damn careful here. Because we might get the Crushing Traps. This is not the best. <clears throat> I think we can start with a Pitfall Trap, although this is a bit uh, odd. We got two moves, four moves. Why are they <laughs> Apparently it still worked out. I don't know. I can play the Mover Man, but it's, it's not that great. Even if I play Yorvet now, what he plays next will just die. So, it's kind of pointless. The big tree's gonna blow up. Onward, oh, I'll just go with that. I trust no one. Never have. Okay. Immune? Really? I don't know. Maybe we're just gonna play Yorvet now. Enough of this farce! Fedrai Enlay! You should expect a pitfall trap. Slaughter them to a man! Peace with humans. There's not much I can do. Alright, that's the problem. What? That's immune too? Great. What? Oh my god. Is this guy wanna take the, uh, the medal for being the most boring person alive? He has a shell moon skags as his last move. Yeah, this guy figured out the meta. If I have just immune stuff that doesn't die, cannot be targeted, I'm good. And he's fucking right. That's the fucking meta. People who just spam removal, big fat guys with removal. And that's it. We got 8 more points, but I think we're just gonna lose this because he has a boosted shell moon skags. Oh no. 
Apparently it's not not big enough. It was a baby. Well, that's it. GG! Uh, anyway. Maybe we just kick the Elven Scouts. And this could be really good, but maybe we kick the Crushing Trap. Anyway! Story times. It's not the best story, guys. It's, it's gonna be a... Well, you will be the judge of that. It's not not really great story. Anyway, there were some chicks there that I wanted to impress. And I got into my mind. I'm gonna swing that swing that you just... Uh, that you hold with both hands up. Uh, just the, like top and just like swing yourself like crazy. And of course, I managed to fall pretty badly. Like, very badly. So much so that I lost consciousness. It wasn't the best. And this kind of said by a guy who basically lost consciousness that, that one time. Consciousness that one time in his life. So it was bad. And I kind of like messed up my chin for like 10 years. But it's not visible now. I hope Vault Hunt gets reward too. Hello all. Uh, keep up telling <laughs> Grandpa and Andrew. Well, that wasn't the best story. But kind of that's kind of how... It it kind of reminded me of uh, getting stabbed in the eyes, for some reason, but not sure why. I'm weird that way. Oh my god, it's Meath. Walnush Shal. What's Shal? So that's Walnut, and Shal is... Is it? Is it? Well, I just want to know. <clears throat> when did you manage to go to Africa, and why did you kill that zebra for your jacket? Oh. <laughs> I got it. Fuck. I kind of want to lock that. Well, we both like a long round, so maybe I'm just gonna... ...not play much here? Yeah, let's do a Dried Matron. I gotta figure out the zebra story, how I got my jacket. <laughs> Crap. I didn't think of this, but I'm gonna need the cover story. But how did I acquire this? Well, um... I got in the store when it was legal. Definitely didn't kill a zebra in the local zoo for it. Just saying. If you heard something like that, that some, like, gaunter killed a zebra in the zoo, and ate it, and made a jacket out of it, on the spot. That wasn't me. Just saying. That was someone else. How many powder you have? Not a lot. Okay, we can just play... Sentry, maybe? He's generating a lot of value, too. Can I just do it with the guys I have? Should be able to, right? He's generating free value. This is gonna be... I'm generating 2... Plus 2... Plus this guy's a 9. Well... Gonna... I think we should be good. But it's a little close. Kayam! And this gets played. Let us sing the song of steel. And I managed to keep the lock. And the most important cards. Pass Rooney, we're going to Long Grand Free. Okay, pretty decent. Walnut Shell means uh, Peel of Walnut. Oh. Shell. Walnut Shell. Right. I know a little German. I even thought about playing some. Because that's kind of a good tip 
Because I was I was paying attention. Uh, how do you guys? Uh, mainly, mostly John was learning languages. It's like using the language. Uh, that's a pretty important part. And I, I can really attest to that because the reason I picked up English is not because I was taught a little bit of English, but because I, I kept using it. I don't know if you want that, but these are just some excellent cards. I think we kind of want all of that. We're just gonna pass. You can see them uh, when they are fresh. Uh, get your fresh nuts here. Ah, uh, that sounds a little dirty. Do you know a little German? How about big Germans? <laughs> no. No. Germans are a little. Okay, let's throw this back. And uh, now we got all the traps. We got Ragnarok, and this looks pretty good. I thought about maybe like playing a game with German. The thing is, that's kind of the bad part is that. Okay. I think we're just gonna Ragnarok that. Is that I'm not really sure where, where I would use German, even if I picked it up. That's kind of where my, my Russian went. Because I, I, I learned like Russian for two years in, uh, in elementary school. Well, that's basically the. More like. It's kind of different in, in countries because sometimes you have got elementary, secondary, and high school. Uh, in Hungary, you've got elementary school for eight years. Uh, that's kind of how it works. Anyway. That's the first school, then the second school, you got the high school from uh, 15 to like 14 to 18, kind of. Anyway. Uh, I, I learned Russian in elementary school, and it was okay, along English, and I just, I just, I just really suck at it, like, I don't know. Ich bin ein Berliner. So, you live in Berlin. You're a Berliner. <laughs> I think I would be able to tell that, even if I, if I didn't speak a little German. Tell us a story in Russian. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know about that. Uh, we can move that in the back. And even if he gets them out, then the Ragnarok is like guaranteed value, which is pretty good. I don't know if I've unlocked that. He has so many useful stuff that I've unlocked. What's your opinion on the state of Gwent currently? I actually thought about making a, a video like that myself. Um, I think it's pretty good. I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, but I would like it shifted more towards... Uh, a little, little more interaction. I think the neutral cards are a little bit oppressive. Some of them are and just show up in many decks. I think that's... Uh, where I would, what I would address first, personally. I would like to see more deck identity because uh, my my major criticism was at in one stream is that I just kept going up against the basically the same deck in different faction. It was just like removal. Well, it, we kind of had the same thing before. We had like the. The Unicorn Chironax with like the Frenzied Dao and whatnot. What is it? The Frenzied Dao? Oh, no, it's the Ifrit or whatever. Anyway, just a four power, four damage guy. It's like, okay, sure. Juiciest in town, get him here. Joan, what's your obsession with uh, the pyramids? <laughs> be saving the log because he might get out something that's just gonna be crazy good value. Princess says. Oh no. He very likely doesn't have an artifact counter. 
but we might as well start with uh, Mahakam Horn, just to not give him a target. Alright. On the shell. Old classic. Tamaria has yet to speak its last. What do you guys think about the state of Grant? I would like to hear that actually. Was there a topic about this on Reddit? Oh, you comment. I, I thought for a second that's gotta be the stream title. It was like a little odd. Is, is it just gonna trigger instantly now? What does he want to trigger instantly? Should I lock that right away? I don't have a way to kill it. But that, is he really packing a lot of units with orders that need zeal? Why not play this before the Blue Stripes Commando? Move it. Oh, you're, you're kind of right. Find the princess and wait. I always fuck that up. I always forget that he's melee only. Um, yeah, you're right. Let's just move it in. Uh, we probably should have done that before. We have still free movement. I can basically delete what he has right now uh, without giving it much thought. It's another melee only guy, so I guess we're gonna throw him back and play a pitfall trap. Alright. I need to know the way. For a second, I thought that's gonna be. Whoa! We managed to catch the drug! <laughs> It's gonna be, uh, like, uh, like, I don't know, Chinese or something. Okay, let's play Yorvid's Gambit. What he has right now is dead. So, his last card better be awesome. Actually, no, no, no. We already used up... He, three points is... Okay. He has three points. Actually, four points. I don't want to sell him short. Yeah, I know how that feels. I played a little bit of Meave, and um, it's not too bad, but it's not Squirtel. GG!